Hello and welcome to chapter five, lesson one. We're on page 189 and our essential question, what are some ways you can describe a pattern in a table? Not like your dinner table, but this kind of table, kind of a chart, right? So let's get in here and unlock the problem. The outdoor club is planning a camping trip. Each camper will need a flashlight. One flashlight uses four batteries. You can imagine that. How many batteries are needed for eight flashlights? If I had one battery, one flashlight, I need four batteries. So if I have eight flashlights, how many is that? It's four, 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 four. Right? Four many times. So this table is helping us. We've got the number of flashlights across the top. We're thinking count by ones. And in the bottom row, we've got the number of batteries. So they told us this, right? That there's one flashlight has four batteries. So now we're just gonna keep track. The table helps us organize our thinking. Two flashlights, well, we just double four, right? Is eight. Three flashlights, I need to add, adding one more flashlight. So I add four more batteries. I'm thinking count by fours. Four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24. That's how we roll our fours, 28. Bet you know it. Well, let's see. Look for a pattern to complete the table. As you look across the rows, you can see that the number of batteries increases by four for each flashlight. So for every flashlight, add four batteries, right? Because our one flashlight needs four batteries. So for every flashlight, you have to add four more batteries. So let's use the pattern to find the number of batteries in eight flashlights. We are going to add, remember, four to 28. Now we are at seven here, right? So we're adding four, and that gives us four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24. That's how we roll our fours, 28. 32, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, right? We're adding four, gets us a 32. So 32 batteries are needed for eight flashlights. Now there's another way you could think of this. You can look for a pattern by comparing the columns in the table. You can multiply the number of flashlights by four to find the number of batteries that are needed. So if we know that we're gonna need four for each of them, we could think, oh, two times four is eight. Three times four is 12. Four times four is 16, right? And eight times four is 32, right? So we could think of the pattern that way. It can either grow across the row or we can think of what do we need to multiply by. So eight times four is 32. And why is it important to know how many batteries are needed in one flashlight? That number four, the four batteries in the one flashlight, told us what we needed to multiply each the flash, number of flashlights by, right? It told us one of the factors. So this four is how many batteries are in one flashlight. Flashlights number of batteries, right? That's one of the factors. And then this is the number of flashlights. All right, we're turning the page to 190. And we're going to try a new, oops, I froze. I'm gonna stop for a moment. 